So there you are. After weeks of convincing, you try your friend's ice bath for the first time. I already know what is the first thought that is going through your mind. Wow, this is great. How can I make one for myself? Welcome to my stupid, simple, do-it-yourself, easy, all-season ice bath build tutorial. Here's the six materials. Let's get into it. Acquire a chest freezer that works, something that you can also fit in. See if you can get one that is secondhand that saves you money. Use silicone to seal the seams, something that will withstand being in extreme temperatures and being continually submerged in water. To make sure it lasts you longer than a season, look into aquarium grade silicone or even some epoxy putty. A GFCI extension cord for that extra layer of protection when we are putting water and electricity close to each other. A temperature controller to set your freezer to optimal ice bath temperatures of 0 to 4 degrees Celsius and a floating pond de-icer. I've gotten best results from just plugging the de-icer directly into the GFCI outlet as it seems to be already thermostatically controlled. Take your chlorine tablets and toss it in the ice bath. An important note for safety, always unplug and disconnect all forms of electricity from your ice bath before use. A great way to ensure this is to design your ice bath in such a way that you have to unplug it to even open it up. 